Mwanda Kirinji. Mimi ni mwalimu wa shule ya msingi ya sekondari. E, tumekuja hapa siku ya leo kwa kuwa tujaridhika, hatujafurahia na jinsi ambavyo serikali inatuchukulia sisi kama walimu ambao wanafunza e, sekondari msingi. Kwa hivyo e, tumesema tumeanza mgomo kwa kuwa tunatarajia serikali itatupea barua za permanent ndio tuendelee kufanya kazi ambayo tumekuwa tukifanya. Lakini kwa kuwa waja tupa hizo balua tunasema ya kwamba tumeanza mgomo siku ya leo. Ni ukweli ama ni uongo? Ni ukweli ama ni uongo? Kwa hivyo sisi kama walimu wa junior secondary tumeanza mgomo siku ya leo na tunapasha habari kwa wazazi wa watoto ambao tunawapenda tunawafunza kwamba wakae na walimu wao, watoto wao nyumbani. Ni ukweli ama ni uongo? Wazazi wakae na watoto wao nyumbani? Kabisa. Wazazi wakae na watoto wao nyumbani? Kabisa. Hiyo ndiyo jambo ambalo tunasema siku ya leo. Na santa. Kwa nini kwa nini mnaenda mgomo? Tunaenda mgomo kwa sababu jinsi e, mwaka ulipoanza tulisign kandalansi ambayo ilikuwa nasema baada ya mwaka mmoja tutapoa barua ambayo itatuajiri permanent. Lakini baada ya mwaka mmoja hatukuweza kupoa ile barua. Tunaambiwa kwa tunaambiwa ya kwamba tumekuwa contract nyingine ambayo ni ya mwaka mwingine mmoja na tukipata kitu ambayo ni duni. Shilingi elfu saba ya mwalimu ambaye ako na bachelor's degree ni pesa mzuri. Hiyo ni pesa mzuri. Hiyo ni matusi. Kava mm. uh, JSS in Tan in Tarakanithi County and we are here again like we have been doing the whole of last week downing our tools. We have decided to down our tools. No teacher will be present in class. Mm. Yes. We have That's... told the parents maybe they have they may have thought that we'll be shaken by the sentiments of our president but we are not going to class we are not the learners we are right now in school with no teacher mm. yes. this is the classroom that we were talking about this yes. is where we'll be till we receive letters of confirmation yes. now we have we we know and we have seen me members of parliament we have seen uh, the cabinet secretaries especially our cabinet secretary mashogu giving letters mm. in burials mm -hmm. on Permanent yes. on pensionable terms yes. to 2023 graduates, 2022 yes. graduates. Yet there are, there are some interns who are who graduated in 2020, 2015 have taught outside for more than 10 years mm -hmm. and now are here on internship for another two years. Mm -hmm. that, yes. is, that, that is that is manipulating. Yeah. That is yeah. manipulating these teachers. That is uncouth and it is unconstitutional. Amazing. We are downing our tools. We are not showing up in class. We have seen replacement uh, uh, posts being advertised. And they're not given to us. They're they given to people who are just who just uh, graduated right. the other days. And members of parliament are, are considering them first. Mm -hmm. So what of us? Are we are we people of are we people who are not are not members of this children country? Of are we children God. of a lesson God? We expect <laughs> no. the government to follow the procedure. Yes. yes. Teachers were being employed on internship before Ruto came. Teachers internship post had 30 marks. Right now, the internships have no marks. Mm. That means the teachers, the teachers who are subjected to internship, teaching 14 subjects, mm. teaching with 17,000, are no longer eligible for these posts. Yes. Mm -hmm. We want to understand which criteria is sure, being yeah. used. Yes. We have gone to Nairobi. And the, we have gone to Nairobi. We mm. have issued them with, with, with the strike notice that is supposed to begin tomorrow, meaning from tomorrow, officially notice.